Hey guys, welcome back. Um, this is a video that I was hoping I wouldn't have to make, um, but I did not make a good run in stage two. I uh, ran out of time and um, decided to change the motor in ESC, and I'm not, uh, it was my really my first uh, Mamba Monster X. Um, my first attempt at programming and something that I did, um, I'm going to plug the car in real quick and show you guys. Um, I went in and I tried to make some changes to the ESC and <clears throat> what I didn't do was I changed, I cut off the LiPo and... I didn't hit update to send it to the car. It's buried over here in the corner. Um, I don't know if you guys can see that. Right down here in the very bottom. Um, for those of you guys who have no experience like me with uh, these products, if you do not hit update, send settings to device, nothing you do in any of this um, will change. So, When you make any changes up here, um, so as you can see now, I have no cutoff on my lipo. So when I was making my runs in this video, and I only posted one, the very last one, because the other ones were exactly the same. So I didn't want to bore you guys with 20 minutes of videos of the car not doing anything but you know 84 miles an hour. So and then it would cut. So it would, it would get the the battery down to the cutoff voltage and the car would stop. I could still steer it, but it wouldn't go forward reverse anywhere. So I had to run down and get the car uh, twice on a road where it almost got ran over. So I moved to my uh, low stress spot to try again, uh, which is the video that's in here. Uh, and it got all the way to the very end again and just cut out. So I called it, it was the last day. Um, so anyway, the stress is off. Um, I can kind of do what I want to, take my time with this car now, uh, move on to the next project, you know, how that goes. So those of you guys who are still in it, I wish you the best of luck. Um, I'll be rooting for you guys. So stay in there. I know there's some very fast ones out there and I was hoping to be up there, but hey, I'll still get this one fast. Uh, it just won't be in a contest, which perfect. So anyway, uh, here's the video, guys. Um, anybody has any questions about this castle stuff? Uh, there's plenty of videos out there, but again, um, just don't make the mistake of not clicking update over here on the car. Um, she was ready to go, guys. She was ready to go. So I'm still gonna make a run with it now that I've figured out um, how to work, work this, so, uh, and also to make sure that it did work, so. Anyhow, here's the run, guys. Um, thanks for watching. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. And uh, check the links because I'll have everything that I put into the car uh, in the links. Y'all have a great day. All right, guys. I'm going to make one last attempt with the 917 in this Stage 2 deal. I've got 12 satellites. Zeroed out. Tracking. Date is Sunday the 30th of July. Let's show tracking it one more time. Okay. This is probably a terrible idea on this road, guys, but I ran out of time. Uh, it was cutting on me on the first two runs. I think I got the low voltage turned off on it, the LiPo uh, auto on there, but I also turned off the, 
the idle beeps and it's still doing it so I don't know if this worked or not so we're just gonna find out Turn around. All right, guys. I'm gonna send it if it'll go. And it's cut on me again. See, 84. So that's the fastest it's gone while still cutting. All right, guys. I only got back from the walk of shame here. I'm gonna stack of duct tape. I've been collecting since speed running started here with me. So just to see, I'm going to take the temperatures again, so I just don't see So it's, hopefully you guys can see that, 114 There's no fan on it, so you know, there's a couple minute walk, but it didn't cool off that much in just a few minutes Nothing seems to be too hot on this car. So I think it's pulling too many amps. Like I said, I went into Castle Link and tried to disable the uh, cutoff on it. It was set for auto lipo. And uh, I also disabled the neutral beep. Um, that did not work either. So, I'm not sure, guys. I'm not sure. It was, uh, it was scooting. It stayed straight. I mean, you know, there was a time where I was really happy with 80s. It does look like I need to put thicker weight in the rear now because the front's got a million in it. This is 100,000 and it looks like it's maybe losing traction back here. But, uh, guys, I'll keep at it. I know I'm not in the Arlarlo contest anymore, but uh, I do love the challenge. Uh, 
one thing I do like about not being in the challenge anymore is I can get rid of that body and do what I want. So, uh, those of you guys who are still in the contest, good luck to you. Um, I had fun and I've enjoyed building this car over and over. <laughs> but, uh, y'all have fun and stay safe. I'll have links to the stuff I put in this car down below. So check those links. If you're not subscribed, uh, do me a favor and subscribe. Leave me a comment. Uh, I'll try to put up a log on this and see if you guys can identify what's going on or what I did wrong. But uh, you guys have a wonderful day. And thank you for watching.